Hi, this is Mark Petrie. I'm a Just in Mind customer, but more importantly, I'm a huge fan of this prototype software. If you're like me and you're responsible for developing websites, software, or even mobile applications, then you probably already know that screenshots and wireframes, they do a little bit towards helping you convey what you're after within a project, but they don't do it all. And that's exactly why you need the Just in Mind Prototyper software. So let me cover the four most important reasons why I love this application. First, it's really easy to use. It has a simple drag and drop interface, so if you want to assemble the layout of your screens, you can do it very, very quickly, as quickly as any wireframe software that's out there on the market right now. Secondly, you can create powerful interactions, and this is where it really adds a lot of value to your projects. The ability to show what does a hover look like, and screens, and, and the uh, clicks, and vents, and things like that. It's a great way to create that interactivity within the screens that you create. Third, there is a simulate button. And for those people out there who are used to using other prototype software, you'll love the simulate button. It is a fantastic way to quickly check your work on the fly without having to go through the process of rendering out all the HTML or documentation. And finally, there's a fantastic amount of extras that Just in Mind has put onto their website that you can use as the basis of your projects or just widgets within a given project. And we'll cover a little bit more about those. So let's go ahead and dive right into an actual project I'm working on for hire. Do it yourself or hire a pro. Essentially a search engine of simultaneously searching how-to videos on home improvement projects as well as displaying a list of qualified professionals in your area so you can either do it yourself or hire a pro. So we are doing a big search engine uh, that will display videos and things like that. Let me just show you how easy the drag and drop interface is. First and foremost, if I want to add a, an image, I can just drag it in, drop it into my workspace, and then I can use the Properties tab to grab the image that I'm after, an iPhone screen, and I can resize it. So you get some sense that it's very similar in nature to a wireframe software in its drag and drop nature. But then I can use the Events tab to make the interactions that I want. And I'll do a real simple one, an on-click interaction. And I just add the interaction, and I just want it to link to my eye for hire. Boom. Now I have not only the layout of the screen, but I also have interactivity programmed into it. So I can now test my work by hitting the simulate button. And this is where the huge time saver comes in, as opposed to generating the full HTML prototypes every time. But I can make sure that I put the right click. Did I do it? Yes, I did. It went to the right page. OK, so that worked. And I can test out all the different uh, simulations that I want inside of here. Once I'm done developing the prototype, or at least at a release that I want to share with my internal staff or clients, I can then generate the HTML. And boom. It generated the HTML and it opened up my default web browser and here I am and I can test the application itself and show all the stakeholders and I can put in for example lawnmower because I want to see the types of results that I get when I search and here's the layout that I've created for that search results page and I can create interaction after interaction after interaction it completely simulates how this entire web-based piece of software is going to work for uh, the users and that's great for getting the stakeholders to know exactly what's going to happen as well as the developers to let them know this is how we expect it to look once it's in the hands of the users so it's a huge time saver in that regard it will save your timeline on your project and it will most certainly save you uh, budget so the final thing that I wanted to cover is the widget library and the downloads that are available just go to the justinmind.com website and you can hit the downloads page to find all the widgets that you might want for any type of project that you're working from I'm going to go, I downloaded the iPhone widget library because my next project is an iPhone application and now I'll have all the screens that I need to be able to create a killer iPhone app. 
So that's a little bit about why I love this prototype software by Just in Mind. I hope you'll go to their website, try it out, and ultimately I'm sure it will become a powerful tool in your development war chest. Thanks so much for your time.